Hello everyone, Eric Chappelle, Community Evangelist for InfraWorks 360, and for today's Infra Tip, I'd like to show you how you can use the control key to control what happens when you're adding to a design road. So to get started, I'll launch the Local Roads tool, and I'll choose a style that's obviously different than what I have in my model right now. And you'll notice when I move my cursor near the road, the geometry lights up, the black for the tangents and the blue for the curves. And if I click on the road while this geometry is visible, then it turns to an append mode. So I'll click here, and you'll notice as I draw in the model, it's continuing that design. And if I start to click a few points, and double click and eventually finish the command, you'll notice that it used the style that was already assigned to that road, and it actually just continued that road. It added to it by adding points to it. So I didn't create a new road, I just extended the one I had. So let's undo that so I can show you the difference. This time I'll launch the local roads command, and same deal, I'll choose a different style, but I'm going to hold my control key down when I pick this point. And I'll pick near the end. Now when I do my layout, notice I don't get any curves. So I want to be careful if I'm doing something where I'm putting roads end to end, I want to make sure I'm along the same alignment as the previous road. But now I'll continue my layout, double click to finish, and you can see that it's a completely different style. And if I tie these roads together properly, we should get a transition between the two styles. There we go. So the difference there was that I used the control key when drawing the road so that it didn't append, it actually created a new road and intersected the two together. Now we don't often think of an end-to-end -end as an intersection, but that's how InfraWorks 360 treats it by transitioning the different lanes into each other. So we get a pretty nice smooth transition between the two roads there. So that's how the control key can help you when you're adding design at the end of a piece of design road that's already in your model.